You see, you see, you see that. That is the kind of book I want to read. That, that's the kind of book I like. Not that. Alright guys, so I've been working on this song. The ultimate goal of me getting the program that I've been doing is to, to create a, a song that I could use in the vlogs versus using copyrighted material. Uh, you know, like I did in the first two vlogs. So, um, <laughs> and I'm working on something. I think this one's actually going to be happy this time. Uh, so, because the last two were kind of like a dark beat, you know, I felt like I should be like in an alley somewhere in the hood or something. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, uh, this one's going to be kind of cool. I hope, uh, y'all need to leave feedback though on any suggestions or comments or anything. Just, uh, let me know what you think. And there, among all the clothes, was one jacket without matching pants. <laughs> yep, that's right. I'm going to a wedding, and uh, I've got my, got my suit coat, and um, I have no pants to go with it. It'd be kind of an awkward wedding, so... Got to go get some pants today that match this black. I don't know. It's kind of a generic black, but I gotta go to, I guess, JCPenney or something. Gotta find pants that match. Gee. Okay, so this is awesome. I just got off the phone with my dad, okay? I love this. Seven second conversation. It was perfect. See, here, here's, the, here's the deal. It's, it's like a pet peeve of mine when someone calls you and they need something and they take like 20 minutes and talk to you about everything and then say what they need for last. It's like, Arr. my dad calls me. He's like, hey, is mom there? I'm like, no, she's not home yet. Okay, bye. I'm like, bye. Like, that's perfect. That is perfect. And unless I'm talking to like a friend. Like getting to know them or, you know, whatever. Just kind of chilling on the phone with a friend or something like that. But when someone calls me and they need something and they want to be like, Hey, how's your day today? You know, what you doing? It's like, what do you want? <laughs> anyway, never mind. I'm, I'm. What's up, you guys? I just finished dinner. I had 24 chicken nuggets. Holla! And now I'm off to a belt to go get some pants. I don't know. What do you guys think? Yeah. With my warrior shirt. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> so, really quick, uh, about the little shopping experience there. One, I already saw two people I knew. Two or three people in there. Uh, so, again, just goes to show you the small town. <laughs> um, another thing is, they were playing Christmas music, holla, I'm about that, <laughs> I told the lady at the counter, I was like, it's like, I'm about this Christmas music, I'm about that, and, uh, also, that was really fast, I went in there, and as soon as I get in there, just turned to my right, saw pants, uh, saw the dress pants, I, I, you know, I got, first ones I walk up to, matched, just looked for my size, got them, tried them on, boom, Checked out and was ready to go. So that was really awesome. So this is going to be a test right here because I've had a lot of people. Shut up, phone. Because I've had a lot of people telling me, you know, Josh, you shouldn't be holding your camera while you're driving and this and that. So I'm going to try just putting it here in my cup holder. How do I look? Because hands free. Both hands can be on the wheel. Ooh, that's kind of tricky. Where's my arm going to go? What about this? Because I'm going to be doing this for a year, and you guys are right. I really shouldn't be holding my camera while I'm driving. So if this angle works really good, um, I might just put it in my cup holder. So we'll see. I don't know how that's going to look. What's up, guys? I'm at the Goody Shack 2, just waiting on a friend. We're going to talk some filmage about filming and stuff. Because uh, this is fun. It's a fun hobby, and so it's awesome when you find someone else that likes to film. So we're going to talk about filming and stuff. I'm at the Goody Shack, though, like I said. I, I have never been in here. I don't know if any of you guys have. It's the Goody Shack, too. See the sign? 
The sign says world's best hot dog. Now that's a statement right there. That's a big statement. World's out of the whole world. This small town's Goody Shack <laughs> 2, the Goody Shack 2, has the world's best hot dog. <laughs> it's not that I'm wanting to doubt what they're saying. It's not that I'm wanting to, like, uh, second guess them. But just something about that, I'm, I'm, kind, of, I'm kind of doubtful about that. So, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I ate like 30 chicken nuggets though, so I'm probably not gonna eat anything. Me and my camera, me and you guys are just chilling. Uh, just hanging out, having a dialogue here in my car. People walking around think I'm crazy. And I'm okay with that. Okay, just one more thing. And this I really don't know if I'm gonna put in the vlog. But if I hear one more girl comparing all guys to the worst level or the worst standard a guy has, like for instance, that dog of a, that sorry excuse for a man that uh, only cares about what the girl looks like, doesn't really care how she acts, you know, stuff like that. Uh, like girls are like, all guys are like that and this and that. If I hear one more girl say that, I'm gonna, I probably won't do anything. But it's like, it's just irritating. Because it's like, so you've had a few bad experiences with guys, and you think they're all the same. It's like me, it's like, it's like me comparing all girls with the same standard Britney Spears hold, holds herself to or something. Like, it's like, what a, I don't know. I don't even know how to express it. Do you guys feel what I'm saying? Do you feel where I'm coming from? Do you feel where I'm coming from? What's up, guys? Day seven, I've been doing this video every day for a week now. Uh, it's been pretty good. My mom likes it. Um, don't you, mom? We just got done having a conversation. She was like, Josh, I don't think you're going to continue it. She was like, I, I can't picture you. <laughs> She's looking at me. <laughs> She's like, I can't picture you. <laughs> I can't picture you doing the video every day for a year. I just can't picture watching day 365. So you guys ever get challenged to do something and then like people are like, you, you can't do it. You can't do it. You know, you're not going to follow through with that. And then you have to. It's like, now I have to. Because, you know, now it's like people don't say I'm going to do it. So it's like, okay, now, I'm, now I've got to do it. So... For those of you that are like just now tuning in or whatever, I'm doing a video every day for a year. Something to look back on, something to have fun with my friends, something to just... Because uh, I, love, I love speaking in front of people, I love videotaping things, and I love editing. So why not do what I love all in three in one? So anyway, this has been one week. What are there, 52 weeks in a year? So one down, 51 more to go. Alright, I'm getting on tape in case you die. I wouldn't recommend this. I'm just saying right now, I wouldn't recommend this.